You want to be less lazy, right? Now this is the goal stated in negative. Less, less lazy. Okay, she said, I want to be less lazy. So the first rule, just take down, look at your notes. Okay, state the goal in positive language. Okay, so I asked her, what is the goal you want to achieve? And she said, I want to be less lazy. So if you hear negative words. Okay, then you ask, so what do you want to have instead? So, you want to be more active. Is that correct? Okay. So, verify, okay? Make sure that you you ask them, okay, is that correct? So, answer want to be Abhi, abhi ho chalega. We'll proceed. Next stage mein ho sab bhi ho jayega. Okay, abhi, just let them state the goal in positive in their words. Jo bhi unka shabda hai, wohi shabda mein humko lena hai. Okay, so Abhi Aplaya Bula, what is the goal that you said? You want to be more active, more active, correct? Okay, now uh, we go to that uh, logical levels and we connect that with her values. So what about being more active is important to you? What about being more active makes it so important? So, because you are not active, you lose out on things that you want to focus on. Okay. You don't give enough time. So, what about being active is important. I am going to say that. If you give you more time, what will it have do for you? Being active. It will help you to get things done. Okay. What else? What else will be active do for you? What is important about being active? Everything, go and tell me. Whatever comes to your mind. So I am eliciting her values. I am taking out why being active is important. Why being active is important? Why being active is important? Because I will assume that and I will be that assumption. I don't want to assume that. Right? So give it a thought. Take your time. We are in no rush. But what about being active is really important to you, to you, okay? Being active, imagine you are active. What is, what is so important about being active? Just take your time, you no rush. Better? Health. Manage your time more effectively. Oh, wow, that's wonderful. What else? Okay. So let me ask you one more question. So what about having a good health is important for you? What does good health mean? Okay. Focus on your work. Well. <laughs> Fantastic. Okay. Take care of people, yeah, and their needs. Wonderful, excellent. Now, just think for a moment, okay? In what possible ways can you think about being more active? Just think in your mind right now. What possible ways can you achieve this goal of being more active? And just let me know one or two possible ways. Sorry? Sleeping less, okay? Okay, so what would you like to do this time? College work. Okay. Anything that one wants. Okay. I'm repeating because you are speaking so softly that people may not be able to hear. So I'm just repeating what she's saying. Um, right. Uh, and uh, now, so uh, let's let's say that your goal is to be more active. Is that correct? Good. So. Um, you know, what do you see yourself doing? Can you, can you think of, you know, what do you see yourself doing to become more active? Good. 
something you see yourself picking up something and doing some work some task correct okay what else do you see yourself doing you can just think of the possibilities you give me uh, two things so anything else that comes to my mind your mind so what do you see yourself doing cleaning up something getting rid of something brilliant is there anything specific that you can see yourself doing in terms of cleaning up something okay. okay so you see yourself cleaning up the bed just to wash stuff as one of the activities great now uh, are you and you alone responsible for uh, achieving this outcome of cleaning up the bed and what else did you say the other two things also mentioned that seeing yourself doing Picking up a task and doing it related to college. Brilliant. So the more specific you get, the more easier it is to achieve the goal. Okay. So are you and you alone responsible? Just give it a thought and uh, let me know. Are you and you alone responsible for <coughs> achieving these tasks, or are they dependent on anyone else? Right. So what part of it you can take full responsibility? You know now. Uh, you know, out of all these tasks, because ultimately you can only control yourself, you cannot control your brother, right? So, what part of the tasks you see yourself doing, and you can now look straight and imagine those tasks being played here, like a movie screen. And what part of these tasks that you are seeing doing right now can you take responsibility for on your own? Okay. Anything else? What else? So what part of making up early can you take responsibility for setting the alarm? Okay, so you can do that. That's all right. We we don't need to you know push her to a point where she is not going to commit. But if you can take that little step, that is an outcome. If you remember the outcome model, right? Okay. Now, uh, what I want you to do is um, think of a timeline. Imagine that this is a timeline. Okay, and that is your future, and that is your past. Okay. Now, think of a time in the future where you see yourself having achieved this goal. Okay, of what was the goal? And being being active. Okay. So think of a time where you see yourself having achieved the goal. So if this was the timeline, this is the future, and I'm going to walk now, and you can show me a point where you think that is the point where I have achieved it. Where would it be? Would it be somewhere here? Would it be here? Would it be here? Here. Where do you see this goal having been achieved? So. Tell me the first stop where you see that having happened. So where would tomorrow be in your timeline? Would it be here? Would it be here? Would it be there? Over here? Is it over here? Is this a fair judgment of tomorrow as a timeline? You can take your call. This could be the end of your life. Or it could be just next week. It's your complete your judgment. Wherever you see, just use your intuition, your gut feel. You know, okay, my future is here. So, this future may come here, be showing here, or so here, be showing here, or next week here, be showing here, or whatever you think. It's your call. Where do you see this? This is tomorrow. Okay. Is this a fair assumption? Okay. 
So when you do the exercise also, uh, you have to lead, let them decide where is their time uh, future. Okay, because they know their goal and they know how they are setting their time. Right? But when they say, tell you a point, make sure that it is absolutely clear to them. So you ask them, show confirm, them, recon confirm, reconfirm. Huh? So this is somewhere where you would call as tomorrow, right? Okay, so what I want you to do is take a step to the side. One more step. Okay, imagine that there is an image of you over here. Okay. Uh, sorry, I think it's Jonas. How do you spell? Jonas. So there is another Jonas over here. Okay, now I want you to take a step here, come here, okay, and step here into tomorrow. This is your future timeline, and you are here tomorrow. Okay, and uh, just be in this moment, close your eyes, and just imagine having achieved that goal okay, of being a kid. Okay, and as you are experiencing this, having achieved, okay, uh, what qualities in you have brought you to achieve this goal? Just think about that. What qualities? in you that you have has helped you in achieving this goal. Qualities could be you know, being determined, determined, strong will, whatever. Just tell me what qualities in you that helps has just just so so that the audience also makes some of determination, strong will, okay? Brilliant. So, you are a person who is very determined and this determination has made this change in you. Correct? Okay. Now, just be in that moment. Okay. And what do you see? Just you now you don't need to tell anybody because it is your own vision. Okay. Uh, and what do you see? Just close your eyes and be in that moment having achieved that outcome. What do you see in your eyes? around you, take a look around you, okay? take a look at the people around you, what are people saying about you, having seen this change in you, just go into that moment, and just hear what people are saying, yeah. and what are you saying to yourself? Those words in your mind. What are you saying to yourself? You are tomorrow. You are now where you wanted to be, having achieved that objective. And for a moment, just scan your body and try to feel how, how good will you feel. And where in your body are you experiencing those feelings? You know, just scan your body and imagine those feelings. Going into your body, and only you know where they are in your body. Having achieved this goal of being active and being determined and strong, and take a deep breath now and just try to imagine how this feels, how this smells, how does success smell, how does having achieved your goal smell like. As you see this whole picture of you, as you hear what people are talking, as you hear your own voice having achieved this and being so strong willed and determined, okay? Just imagine what have you personally gained from this experience. And you don't need to tell anyone here that it's your own thoughts. What have you gained from this? Look around in your mind's eyes, you just be there in that moment. And how has this journey affected the people around you that really matter to you? How has this journey affected the people? Just look at their faces right now. If they are 
saying something, just hear their voice. Just hear them say how nice it, it is that you are you are active. You're taking actions. And how is this achievement affecting the people around you? How is it how is that affecting them? What are they experiencing? How does this accomplishment fit around other areas of your life? I'm sure you will have other areas of priority in your life. And now that you have become active, how does it fit into your other areas of life? And now think about what did you have to sacrifice to achieve this goal? sleep, maybe a bit of effort, I don't know, you know it better, but what did you sacrifice to achieve this goal? And was that okay with you? And was it also was it okay with others around you? Brilliant. Now what I want you to do is turn around, turn around, turn around completely. Now look at that. Other person standing here, the other you have. Okay? Imagine her in your mind's eyes. You can close your eyes, just imagine her. She is still there in the past. Right? And as you think back, just think what steps did you take between today and the next 24 hours? What specific steps did you did you take? And then what other steps did you take? What actions did you take? And now just imagine before reaching this spot, which is where you are today, tomorrow. Right? Okay, what was the last thing that you did do? In terms of action, what was the last thing you did? And if there were obstacles, just think of two or three obstacles that you overcame as you reached and crossed this path to the top. Fantastic. And just think about what kind of resources, you know, energy, positivity or uh, you know, any energy, any, any that you pulled on from from around you or from within your body, or whatever resources you needed to draw on, willpower, okay, or ability to say no when you didn't want to go to sleep, or ability to say yes when you really wanted to jump to action. What kind of energy did you pull on? What kind of inner strengths you used to reach this point? Achieve this task, you know, being active. 
all of this team will do job. Just do a move. Just watch yourself. How differently are you behaving? How differently are people looking at you? What are they saying about you? How does this change your future? What do you see? What do you hear? Awesome. Right. So, starting now, okay, I want you to come back here. Come back to the original position. Step into your own body. Not really a direct And now, think, you know, starting now, what must you do first? Just think, what must you do first? And what time? Exactly, that you do this. Yeah? Right. So, when are you going to let me know that you have taken action? Tomorrow you have to achieve, right? So, when are you going to let me know you are taking action? You have to start doing some action. Right? So, how will you let me know? So give me my email address. Will you drop me a mail that you have taken some action? Sure. Excellent. Right. And how will you keep visiting, revisiting this plan? You know, whatever actions you are taking from tomorrow to future. How will you keep revisiting the plan? What that you are doing? You know, every day you will get an outcome. How will you revisit it? Will just make it as now. How will you know that the plan is working? Just give it a thought. And if you like, you can even send me your plan, okay, by email. And it will be good to review it. And if you don't want to send it to me, send it to someone in this room whom you are comfortable with. Okay. She is most comfortable. <laughs> <laughs> she doesn't trust anyone. <laughs> All right. Okay. Thanks. Thanks a lot. Yes, yes. How does that make you feel? Was it different?